Hi, I'm Jeff Stokes. Welcome to Jeff's Daily Dose of Encouragement. Today I want to encourage you to look to Jesus. In Luke chapter 21, Jesus describes basically what's going to happen in the end times and <clears throat> how, how much of a tumultuous time it is. And there'll be wars going on everywhere in people's hearts failing them it says uh, for fear and all the things of all the things that are coming on the earth and obviously tribulation and, and the trouble and, and with Israel itself with Jerusalem being surrounded by armies etc etc and then he says in there then take heed to yourselves in verse 34 lest at any time your hearts be overcharged with surfeiting and drunkenness and cares of this life, and so that the day come upon you unawares. For as a snare shall it come on them that dwell on the face of the whole earth. Watch therefore and pray always that you may be accounted worthy to escape all these things that will come to pass and to stand before the Son of Man. So it's going to be pretty troublous times. And just even in, in our lives right now, we can see the world is basically nuts. Um, I mean, we know it's caused by sin, but it's almost like everyone's got some mental disease or something and they just can't even think straight. Some of the things that are coming that people say these days, you know, with, with a straight face are absolutely outrageous. <clears throat> but Jesus, um, Paul encourages us in Hebrews 12, this very simple thing. That, that we need to do in Hebrews 12 verse 2 looking unto Jesus the author and finisher of our faith if we keep looking to him earnestly looking for him then we won't miss out on that great day when he comes in the clouds or if he tarry we go with an earlier so that's my encouragement for you today to look to Jesus if you don't know the Lord Jesus Christ it is really high time to get your life right with God through putting faith in Jesus Christ and having your sins forgiven so that you can be in the number of those that will be <clears throat> taken up to heaven and, and escape these things. If you don't know the Lord Jesus Christ, if you confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus, it's really simple. If you confess with your mouth the Lord Jesus and believe in your heart, if you truly believe in your heart that God raised him from the dead, you will be saved. For whosoever shall confess that Jesus is the Son of God, God dwells in them, and he in God. And by the help of the Holy Spirit, you can do that. God bless you. Have a great day.